In the late 1960s and throughout the 1970s, space exploration and what was beyond the stratosphere had people in amazement and wonder. This wonder was fueled by events and things such as man walking on the moon, TV shows like Star Trek, Star Wars, Doctor Who, Battlestar Galactica, The Invaders, and many more. This theme of space and science fiction permeated into the music of the time in the 1970s, 1976 to be exact, a music producer and songwriter who made hits for many R&B, soul, and jazz acts would make his debut album. He also wrote songs for many famous artists of the 70s and 90s. His 1976 debut album was soaked with soul-laden keys and piano chords, dynamic guitar riffs, groovy bass lines, horns and orchestral elements, interplanetary and spacey synths, and dope drum patterns that portrayed and personified the sound and wonder of what it would be like to travel in space. There was one song on the album in particular that many hip-hop, pop, and R&B artists sampled for its funky drum break. This song has been sampled more than 283 times. Artists such as Benny the Butcher, J. Cole, Wiz Khalifa, Eric B. and Rakim, Dido, Kid and Play, DJ Shadow, Boogie Down Productions, Pete Rock, Ice T, Digital Underground, Camp Low, Family Stan, Janet Jackson, Boldy James, Two Live Crew, The Ghetto Boys, NXS, K Solo, and many more have used this song. I'm talking about none other than the song Theme from the Planets by Dexter Wansel. He was part of the MSFB. This was the house band to Kenny Gamble and Leon Huff. That means he was one of the session musicians for the Philly International Sound. What's up, Philly? Let's give props to an amazing songwriter and music producer. His name is Dexter Wansel. If you didn't know, now you know. His music made a big contribution to hip-hop, pop, and music all around the world. Thank you for supporting this series. Thank you for supporting me on Facebook. Make sure that you support me on Instagram. Make sure you support me on YouTube as well. This is Things You Didn't Know About Music.